Hello, today, we'll take you on our visit to the Viking Museum Ladby in Denmark. It's the only place in Denmark where you can see the tomb of the Viking in his warship. Our Whippet joined us, capturing the trip on his camera. In this video, you'll witness a real Viking ship, the throwing stones game played by Viking children, and even a moment when a wasp flies in front of the camera. The Viking Museum Ladby narrates the story of kings from the past and life in the Viking world. The museum also hosts various activities for both children and adults, such as archaeology, archery, javelin throwing, Viking combat, handmade ceramics, wood carving, and more. We tried it, and the best was the game of throwing stones at the enemy on the playground for little Vikings. It was fun! Under the Lad Becoming tomb, we can also see the Viking ship Lad Bedrigen. It's an exact one-to-one -one replica of the Ladby ship, built from oak wood, from the local forest, just like the original. The ship is almost 22 meters long and about 3 meters wide. It accommodated up to 32 rowers, and was equipped with a sail. The upper decks, of the ship, are painted with yellow and blue colors, as traces of these colors, were found during excavations of the original ship, in 1935. The bow is shaped like a dragon's head, and the stern like a dragon's tail. In the bow of the ship, lies the original anchor and anchor chain. The ship also contains the remains of horses and dogs that accompanied the king on his final journey. During our visit, we also met another whippet. It was a surprise, because whippets are not very common in Denmark. Our whippet made friends with him, and they played together. It was great! The Viking Museum Ladby is not just about the burial of King Ladby, but also about the entire era of Vikings. In the exhibition Ladbykonen's Verden, we explore the world and daily life from the period of the King of Ladby. Other highlights include the exhibition Viking's Wardrobe, where you can try dressing in Viking clothes, and King and Warrior, presenting the funeral of King Ladby. As we are getting to the end of the museum visit, it's time to mention that dogs are allowed, but only in the outdoor areas of the museum, so we'll skip the tour of the oldest Danish royal tomb, where, in the year 925, the Viking king was buried in his warship, but the visit is definitely worth it. We hope you enjoyed our video. If you did, give us a like and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to write to us. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.